will try to go for a greedy four position doom or bat. I'm guessing it's the doom. Dang, that is greedy. That is Jeez. so risky against Tinker. Good awareness from Pycat. EGM, skirmish over the rune. He could be in trouble here. Shockwave coming in. Misery's got the stomp. He's got to lift him and then run. But, well, Misery actually no mana for stomp. He'll try to do this with first right clicks and blood. first blood. But the boot's up and he's going to walk. Oh, right by Pycat. We'll get harassed by that poison attack. Gets the stomp off, then turns. But that's going to prompt a lift. I think should have just kept our running. Yeah, now runs the other way. But he'll get leap. <laughs> If he takes tower. Body block. Well, that's going to do it. Could cut some shot. Now a dagger. They'll stun Misery, but it won't matter. Sing Sing trying to cover his own retreat. It won't save him. They'll need to snowball this in the mid game. They can't just be content with a, a good start. Oh, well, they find Misery now. Is he baiting? Are they bringing in reinforcements? They do have a teleport up on the Magnus, but no TP in sight. He's busy skirmishing for the top rune. Misery accidentally revealing himself from the tree line. He was... Do Alliance look to defend is the question. Teleports are up on Aki as well as Ape Mother. And now the Haunt comes in. Sing Sing Radiant's getting the tower, tower kill, but now fallen. pursued out by a Spectre Illusion. Isn't a bit of a pickle. They'll end up falling a TPL Bulba, so it's a 79 CS, most in the game. And not most now. It's a Manta right, dude, not a Dragon. They're gonna RP him, skewer him back in, then they Haunt as well, but Pycat stands his ground, pops his mech, and he turns and he'll kill off Ape Mother with Quakefoot in reserve. Lasso from Bulldog, not even bothering to use that. It's a Haunt. And a patient silence. Waits until the dark pack completes. Now they're going to set up with an ice pack. Connects on Misery. It's not a very high level one, though. Doesn't hold him in position for long as Quakefa leaps over the top. Dodge like a butterfly. Get really aggressive. A ice pack creep by killing it off. So let's see where Ape Mother is. He is near the bottom side. And they get the off. lift off. They jump onto Misery immediately to start. The RP's there. It does connect on one. Then they skewer two back. EGM, no stolen RP for him. Looks like they may continue to engage here. No, they're going to back off. Pycat continuing to spam his ultimate out. Every time it cools down, they go, and the Slark, who was doomed earlier, will end up falling. Pycat, St. St. and Bulba may be forced to retreat. Yeah, no Haunt, no Doom. This is actually they have a good time. Flare, even though it's a three on four. But how do you set up this Mystic Flare? They'll have to, they'll have the ultimate Doom. Another Blink Skewer attempted. They'll have to lasso for Batrider, but the multicast finds Fate Mother with him dead. They'll really struggle to keep Tinker out of the base. And now Pycat starts chewing into Misery. They'll finish him off. Looking for reinforcements. Mystic Flare's there. Pycat stick charges at the ready. Doesn't quite have mana. That mana cost change. The mechanism needs to switch to entrance and pop it. No, in the end, ended up getting enough H. Uh, enough, and the enough mana. stolen lasso. Just in the nick of time. They steal the lasso after the initiation and. Not yet. <laughs> Need more Midas's, need another 30 minutes. <laughs> Based on Alliance's recent decision making, I feel like that's the natural reaction for them is, oh, we lost later X, all right, let's get two Midas's. We've we'll got another skewer here, Ape Mother does continue to impress, but the trade may come from Koiko, leaps in, latches on Ake, finishes him off, EGM, dealing Shockwave. Now they may look for Misery, another leap in two seconds, Dark Pack doing okay damage. Oh, geez, they want to back on the Sky the Dispersion, man. They did hold the Rex for now. And now an RP. Skewer connects on two. This time EGM got it though, I believe. No, here we got the skewer. That's not a deal. Koifa doomed and chased down a bit. Loda gonna try to pursue him. It's EGM looks for the skewer through. He will fail on that one. Four dead, and they may lose Pycat as well. The entire squad now in heavy pursuit. This cost them a Spectre buyback. Uh-oh. And a Skyrath buyback quick for a team wipe. A triple kill on the He's not going to. Roach dropping quite slowly. The Haunt in to go. Then they look for the skewer forward. Ape Mother only found Pycat though. And now he gets slowed out a bit. Tries to retreat the other direction. RP connecting on Koikfa. He'll bring down two to start. EGM stole RP. He drops it back the other way. On to Bulldog. On to Loda as well. But they doomed Pycat. And he doesn't seem to be getting the kills quickly enough. Koikfa back into the fray. He bought back for this. And it looks like that's enough. They bring down four. They earn Loda. Can they stop this TP out? Leap. The stun finds him on the high ground. They had vision from the ward across the way. And now Loda is in a very uncomfortable position. They'll throw in a Viper Strike. This time, Koikfa finds the angle. It's a full five-man wipe. But Koikfa in pursuit. Go. He doesn't have a teleport scroll. He can haunt to try and retreat out. Does he go to the top lane, Loda? Where's he gone? Actually, he's gone for top. Oh, he's gone top, but... I think they run him down here with a Bulba stun anyway. Into the tree line that creeps his worst enemy. No! The long range take of that last Viper auto attack follows him through the haunt and ends up getting the kill. Pycat from a world and a half away.
The shot literally heard around the world against the Lions. Now Koikpa jumps in, and then I can get right now while also still having buy -bands. That's not many items that will fill that requirement. Nice man to buy Pycat. Bulldog gonna jump in, but that won't be enough as Koikpa leaps behind the back line. They get two kills. Now Spectre leaping in. Eight Mother jump forward, but he doesn't get off the skewer. He gets multicasted. Oh, that's problematic. Loda with a blade nail. No bueno. They continue to lob stuns and nukes. Tinker able to fight constantly. Alliance only when all their ults are up. And with several ults down, struggle is severe. They may lose Bulba here, but haunt initiation or follow up to this initiation. They find the lasso on Bulba. Do they haunt in to go? They will. As Pycat and Surge just forward, they'll lose Bulba immediately. But Pycat really doesn't care. He pops his Manta, Koikpa joins the phrase. Well, there's your RP, EGM stealing the Doom and then the Ice Path. Thrown out to follow this up, didn't steal RP, but that's damn good enough. They'll lose Pycat, Koikpa still staying. Well, is it good enough? Maybe it's not. Koikpa in a bit of trouble here. He's got a leap in a second. Can he get away from Loda in time? Leaping can't, he burns down, but they deal with the Doom. He got really wants this range, Drax. Yeah. That's pretty much done at this point. And he gets lassoed. Maybe he did stick around a bit too long. Pulled into a Mystic Force. He's still got mech ready though. No real ultimates. Nice Yules. Pre-cast by Sing Sing. His 8 Mother prepared to blink in. He was ready for that jump. What a great to Doom as well. Sing Sing bailing out their, their one position Viper. Essentially that's what he's become. He will cost him his creations where like, oh crap, he got caught. Have their stolen Doom off cooldown. They may go back in on oh, Misery. Blink in. Doom cast now. Tossing him back. They need a multicast here to get the easy kill. They don't get it. Actually, oh, they do, but it's only on the, the, the Ignite. Not ideal. They'll lose EGM. Pycat comes surging back in. Misery will fall. He had Doom off cooldown, but never got to use it. Now Admiral Bulldog on the run. and Buybacks all around. Out. How many buybacks was that? Doom, Mag, and Rubik all popping. There's immediately now to the tree line. Admiral Bulldog isolated, brought down. Oh, I think Loda right here. just giving up too Loda's much. Loda's right stuck. Now. He's he trapped in the trees. He has no haunt, no teleport scroll, no dagger for Christ's sake. Ape Mother only fighting RP on Koikfa, who's very fine with this. He leaps back in. There is a Doom ready to go. Well, maybe not so fine, but now Quota emerges from the trees. Perhaps it's enough to keep him alive. Pops the blade now. Pycat going to work from long range, but Dispersion doesn't do enough. The level deaths will secure the kill. EGM rejoins the fight. The fight that simply won't end. And it seems like Tinker will get the upper hand here in the end. Misery forced back, clubbed by an ogre. That's a tough way to die, the four staff in. Yeah, blink RP skewer, force drag, force force. The concern is if they just let Pycat die twice and, and just look to take the buildings in the meantime. There is a glyph though. And they'll blink, they'll doom Koikpa to start. Now they lasso him to follow. They're gonna focus the Slark here, not worried about the Viper, and Koikpa will fall. Does have a buyback, pops it instantly. That could be problematic as Loda holds onto his own buyback. Slark looking to rejoin the fight. He teleported him in. Still a ways to go for him. So Alliance keep on pressing in. They won't. So that's a Doom down, a Lasso down. They still have their RP. And they're holding on to it. They go right now. EGM, did he manage to steal it? He did a level 2 RP, but he silenced and controlled by Ake. Charges forward against his former teammates. RP's there. Find, I believe that was two. Now the Spectre buyback. Loda haunting it immediately. Koikfa, this would be a dieback if he ends up going down. He whips his leap. Maybe this is the overextension that Alliance needed. Bulba, Bulba dropping low, but a Viper Strike ushers Loda back. Now it's Pycat's turn to retreat. Taker getting slightly cold feet. They'll focus on buildings while the rest of Alliance dealing with the swarm at this point. The Zerglings are in the mid lane, they're through the bottom. They're overrunning your base, killing off your SCVs. Can Alliance hold? They've lost their last outer tower, their last tier three tower. Only the tier four standing as Loda is controlled and kited by a multicast. That's a dieback for the Spectre. With that, Ben, probably GG. Looks like Tinker are gonna take this one and improve to six and one while Alliance will fall to one and four. They held pretty valiantly. I if, they, if their dress was just a tad less greedy, I think they would have been able to hold. This is starting to be frustrating as a spectator. The Doom was just a little over the top, although it did it, I, Like, I thought that was a good four position Doom. I don't feel like Misery was useless. Yeah. How much more can you possibly expect out of a roaming jungle Doom? You know? Man, I read that Team Tinkerino, Victorino. <laughs> Jeez, my... my Mine's getting all confused with this. Well, that was a fuzzy game, and it leaves us now with Tinker 